Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I gotta admit, I'm starting this one a little bit under the weather, and by under the weather, I mean under the sun. Holy crap, it is so hot out here. Luckily, there's a little bit of a breeze, uh, so now that there's a cloud going over, there's a little bit of, uh, you know, escape from the torture. But, yeah, enough of that. We're here at Sebring International Raceway. Uh, we've got two back-to-back -back days of drifting here in Sebring. Uh, we've got a couple of the guys from Team No Tread, a uh, team that I joined recently. And uh, Dennis from Keys Cruisers is actually on the team as well, so this is cool. Not only have we been on the same team from him sponsoring me for a while, but now we're both on Team No Tread, which is pretty sweet. But uh, yeah, we're about to head over to Tech right now, get the day started. Alrighty guys, made it through tech. Uh, driving doesn't start for another like hour and a half. So we just got here early to get a good spot and kind of get situated, but I'm gonna take a chance now to kind of cool off. Maybe go get some food, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I gotta change rear tires, put the body kit back on the car because I had to take it off for the trailer. So there's things I gotta do, but the point is we're no longer in a rush. So yeah, we'll catch up once things start moving again. All right guys. Uh, 15. Uh, driving has started now. They're doing an open class between the two tracks. So uh, I'm just going to go out and do a couple of laps to just kind of uh, start the day. It is so incredibly hot and this event is unique, at least here at Sebring, in that the event actually goes on into the nighttime. So uh, I may very well wait until the sun starts to come down a little bit to actually, you know, go out there and drive. So yeah, but for now, let's get out there. Alrighty guys, uh, it has been quite a while since I've updated you guys not the best at vlogging today but a lot has been going on so i went out for my very first run that run went actually went really good uh i went back onto into the line to go again and the car ended up overheating shut off on me i had to get towed back to the pits i let the car cool down and uh i ended up looking under the car and the radiator was like hanging apparently i had knocked it loose or damaged the radiator support whenever i was uh putting it on and off of the trailer that i came with so I had to figure out a way to remount the radiator, which I did. And then uh, after doing that, I took it out for two runs on the big track, the turn 17, uh, or excuse me, 15 and 16. And the uh, car did great. Uh, first time running 225s back there, so that was great. And uh, yeah, after that, our class was over. I ended up coming back here, and yeah, now we're just waiting for my class to come up again in like 25 minutes. So we're just hanging out, having a good time. Here's uh, the truck show seems to be doing great. There's a lot, a lot of people here compared to last year and even the year before. So I'm glad for the event. Hopefully they're making some money. But uh, yeah, see you on track. Hey, how's it going guys? Uh, this vlog is not coming out great, or at least I don't think so while I'm filming it. It's the next morning. Uh, we went for a couple runs yesterday. I had a ride-along person, so hopefully they sent me the footage. 
but uh, yeah, I don't really have that much to show. Uh, we went on like three runs this morning as like three car tandem. We didn't really get too close. I kind of almost spun. Uh, CJ kind of spun on the other one. So I don't know. Thank you for watching, I guess. And uh, we're going to keep it rolling. <laughs> the, the drift day is going to keep going until 6 p.m. tonight. And it is about to be noon. So we still got most of the day. And I have most of my tires. So yeah, there is drifting yet to be had. Right, guys um, honestly that was probably not the greatest vlog I hopefully got some of that footage from the ride-alongs that I got because I did quite a few but yeah ratchet did great for the most part other than the radiator falling out but that was kind of my fault so I don't really blame the car for that and it was an easy fix so not that big of a deal um, a lot of good practice a lot of third gear practice on the big track so that was pretty cool uh, I definitely made some progress so yeah if you haven't already, guys, please consider subscribing, like, comment, maybe. I don't know. And uh, again, as always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.